Welcome to Tiger Tropics. Sorry for the late upload, but I've got another project on the go. Today I went and picked up this tank for free. It's the um, Jewel Rio 4, uh, 450. There we go. Big old tank. It's a uh, 150. It's 150 uh, by 50 uh, width, uh, 151 length, and 60 something, 66 I think it is height. Um, needs to be resealed. All the silicone needs to be taken out. Um, very, very nice lady basically gave it to me because it started to leak. And obviously, once these tanks start leaking, it's a big problem, especially without this amount of water in it. So um, tomorrow I'll start on the project, and um, hopefully, um, hopefully I'll get it looking good. But the plans is, I'll be painting all this white. All the surround will be white. The cabinet will be white. Um, the the glass obviously it's going to be resealed. All of this is going to be redone um, and all the glass cleaned and then the back of the tank is going to be painted black um, what else needs to do into it uh, I think it needs it needs quite a few bits and pieces cleaned on it as well once once all that's done and then the five foot currently that I've got will move uh, into my room, I'm trying to shift a couple of tanks out of there at the moment. And the five foot that I've got at the moment will turn into a planted tank, like a full planted tank. Same as my 180, but it's I'm transferring that whole look into a five footer, which should be brilliant. And this one is gonna have basically what's in a five footer now put into this one. So the sick has got a little bit more room, an extra 90 litres of room for when they get bigger. So uh, yeah, but there's a whole load of stuff to be done, i.e. the levelling, it's got no feet. Um, so I need to seriously consider what I'm going to do about levelling it. Um, I went and ordered some silver label uh, from Hutton, um, who are really nice, really helpful. I phoned them up. Uh, they advised me what silicone to get. Uh, apparently their silver their, their silver label project uh, project silver label silicone um, is uh, that strong that they're using it in a whale enclosure in Hawaii. Well, that's what they tell me. Um, because something I realised after one week of of researching, um, silicone I've been using by Everlast, I think it is. Um, uh, yeah, Everflex called Aquamate is only suitable for tanks up to 400 litres. Now, I had on Facebook people advise me to use GE1 and stuff like that. These are general silicones and even some of the um, uh, the, the marine approved uh, silicones are actually not made for, for big capacity tanks. See, here in the UK, a lot of the people don't have room for a big tank. So... Uh, I mean, like, even this 450 here is considered really big, but obviously um, in the states, this is um, it's a it's a fair size, but people pushing far bigger than this. Um, but over here, tanks are pretty small, so the uh, silicones you get are adequate. But as soon as you start pushing over that three and a half hundred liter mark. And then there's a big iffy question mark over the silicones that you use, which I've discovered. And Hutton assured me that basically the, the silicone I'm buying from them is more than adequate. So I'll take their word for it. And that's the one I went with. But after one week of research, um, I am none the wiser on, on, on a lot of the silicones that, that are out there. Um, so I can just take the manufacturer's word, um, word for it reseed it, water test it, and fingers crossed, 
everything's fine. Wicked. Wicked. I know, I'll definitely recommend the product. Um, but I'm going to do my, I'm going to do my utmost to try to seal it properly. Um, go through all the right procedures to make sure. I've got acetone coming as well instead of the, uh, the methylated spirits, which I was using before. I've bought some new tools as well to help me uh, strip it down easier. And um, yeah, hopefully once it's done, it's gonna look a peach and it's gonna be safe. And uh, yeah, no problems with it. So that's, that's the plan. So yeah, I'll let you guys know how I'm getting on and I'll post more videos when, uh, when I can. I've got another major video that I did edit, um, a really nice one, it was out and about in London. Um, I did edit it and basically re wrote over the top of it and lost everything that I'd done. So in between rewriting that one or re-editing it, uh, once that's done, that's going to be out. Please check that out. Check this video out. And yeah, um, see you next time. Like and subscribe. Cheers, guys. Thank you.